you tell a story of you and Mike Tyson at a party and you yeah. and Mike Tyson are railing cocaine in a bathroom at a yeah. party. You guys Dude. don't leave that bathroom for two hours straight. Am I wrong? Uh, just two to three hours, I would say. Yeah, at least two hours. What is that conversation like? What what, what takes place it, in that conversation? It, 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 it was crazy. <laughs> it, it, it was some crazy shit. And then, do you know that after that, the next time I, I saw Mike Tyson was when we were locked up together in a psychiatric ward. This is this is fascinating. Yep. And, then, and, 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 and then while we're in the psychiatric ward, I'm begging him to let me run into his fist with my face. <laughs> And, uh, and, and he won't do it, but then we're on the Charlie Sheen roast and we do it. And dude, like the way that, that story is in the gnarly special and you see it happen. And the thing was that you also see Bam break my nose, which happened on, on, uh, the filming for the third Jackass movie. And, and, and I just let it fucking heal crooked. I had a fucking crooked nose for like, for like, uh, I don't know, a year and a half. And then when I, when I run into Mike Tyson's fist, you see, I broke the fucking shit out of it. And some dude cruises up. He's like, yo, I'm a Kung Fu instructor. I got you. And he fucking, he fucking, on the spot at the Charlie Seagulls, he sets it straight. And so, like, problem solved. I got a fucking Mike Tyson Kung Fu nose job, dude. And uh, my, my shit's fixed. And, dude, I love that, that that all comes together in this just, in this synchronistic way dude in the in the gnarly special and as with the whole fucking thing this whole absurd act you see everything happen 